hey guys welcome back to my channel today i am here with another review this one is going to be brought to you by the company omg her hair now before i get started on all the details guys please make sure to hit the subscribe button also turn those notifications on because you do not want to miss out on any of my videos Now I'm just showing you guys some of the items that came in the package, which was the removable elastic band. And they also did include some fly away tamer to lay those flyaways down. Now this unit I'm showing you guys is their light yakky bob wig. I have it in the length 14 inches. It is 150% in density. This one also does have the whole lace bleach. I will show you guys what that looks like. You do get your soft Swiss lace, two combs on the side, a comb in the back and your adjustable straps. And you also get the removable elastic band that you can put on the unit. Just making sure that this one is fitting me well. This one is a little bit big on my head. I believe this is an average cap size. I'll make sure to double check. I'm usually a small and sometimes there are mediums. The average does fit me okay, but this one just was a little bit looser. Now you do get a pre plucked hairline on this unit. Now, of course, if you want it to look a little bit more natural, I would suggest going in and plucking out a little bit more. And then that is what the knots are looking like. OMG, her hair does a really good job with bleaching the knots on their unit. I never feel like it's overdone or that is underdone i really can't see any knots and then once you add the powder on it looks really really good so now i'm just going to go ahead and clip the hair back and just work on cutting off this light Now, I usually will wear the unit glueless, but because it is a little bit big on my head, even with the elastic band adjusted, I am going to have to go in with some type of adhesive. I will be using the bedhead hardhead spray, but I'm only going to focus on putting it just right at the front of the parting space and a little bit on the side, but I'm not going to go by the ear tabs just because of the way that I'm wearing the unit. And on top of that, we quarantine. Like, where I'm going? Where am I going? So this is just gonna be really easy and very quick. So I'm just taking the blow dryer to speed up the process. Now, this is a light yakky texture, and you guys know light yakky is my fave at this moment. I think it looks very natural, and it's very easy to maintain, and it's really easy to style. It took me two seconds to flat iron this hair just because it was already pretty much ready. Even after you washed the light yakky, it's pretty much ready. My main focus was bumping out the top of the unit because it was a little bit humpy. And that's because it was a little bit big on my head. So I want this to lay very, very flat just because with my straight units, I like them to be flat as possible. With curly, like I said, you can always get away with it. A little bit of humpish, but when it comes to like straight, I, it got to be flat. No humps allowed. So then I'm going to just take a little bit of the spray and just kind of swoop over in the very front. And then I'm also going to take the hot comb and just kind of go back and forth until I am happy with how it's laying. So now I'm just going to go into the parting space area with my powder. And then I'm going to also go around the hairline and especially where I sprayed at so that it doesn't look super shiny because sometimes the sprays can leave a little bit of the shine and I like to use the powder to kind of knock it out. Of course, all the products that I am using can be found down below in the description area if you guys are interested in purchasing. Then I'm going to go in with my Garnier Fruity Sleek and Shine Serum and I'm going to run that throughout the hair. This is going to kind of tame the hair and it's going to help knock out any of the frizziness and flyaways that I may notice. However, with this hair, the only flyaways that I noticed was at the top of the hair and then like towards the ends, it was just a little bit dry. But other than that, this hair was easy for me to pretty much run my fingers through with no issues. All right, guys, so this is the final look of the Yaki Bob. I think she is cute. She's giving me everyday vibes, low maintenance, and that's exactly what we want. We do not want to have to put up too much fuss with our wigs right now, okay? Especially if you are even wearing them right now. But I think this one is going to be good to run out and do your errands with. The length is perfect. I have 14 inches once again. This unit does come in the lengths 10, 12, and 14. 
I prefer the 14 inch, but I can definitely rock the 12 inch also. Now, as far as the density goes, the density on this is very nice. They offer this also in the 130% and the 180. I like the 150. I feel like it's not too thick and it's not too thin. It's just looking really natural. The 180 might be a little bit on the heavier side. Now, as far as the parting space goes and the bleach knots, I think they do a really good job with bleaching the knots. I wish the parting space was a little bit longer, but I feel like it gets the job done. It's not doing too much, but it still looks good, okay? Um, this unit, as far as shedding and tangling goes, I honestly did not get a lot of shedding with this unit. It was very minimal. And then tangling, I really don't see this tangling up like that. I don't know, guys. For me, my light yakky units just don't really give me any hardcore problems. So that's one thing I love about light yakky. Now, I did go ahead and come back on camera and show you guys what the side looks like. If you wanted to rock it as a side part, I think it looks really cute. This one is giving me more of a classy vibe. And the other one, the middle part, is giving me more of an everyday vibe. So let me know which side you are feeling, well, which part you are feeling, the middle or the side part. If you guys are interested in this unit, I'm gonna make sure to leave all the links down below. And it's very affordable, so you really can't beat that. And you know, we gotta get ready. We gotta get ready for when the quarantine is over to be fly, cause we all gonna be out and about. Once again, guys, I'll make sure to leave all the details down below. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Once again, turn those notifications on, share and like this video, and I will see you guys the next time. Bye guys.